Hello everyone, this is Derek Duct Tape Man here. First, I'd like to say thank you for going on my channel, watch my videos. Now this video here is gonna be another thing I've been doing for a while. And it's gonna be another road trip. A road trip to a football game. Another high school football game I'm gonna show you. So, I'll show you where I'm going right now. Yep, to another high school football game. This one, I'll be going to Seals Grove, Pennsylvania, where the Seals of Seals Grove are going to be taking on the Bulldogs of Berwick. So, both schools have um, state championships underneath them. And even though both the get teams are going to be having a down year this year, but still, should be a good game. So, let's hope and see, and see you next spot. Now, like every road trip, you gotta do the one thing you need to do, and that is get some gas. So I'm at the Red Apple in Benton. That's where I'm getting my gas from. So good place. I know the people, good people. You know, you gotta get gas for the road trip. So I'm gonna fuel up pretty soon. And um, hope to see you at the next location. Before we continue, there's a verse of scripture I like to read here, and right here it is. Mark 6, 7, and he called unto him the twelve, and began to send them forth by two and two, and gave him power over unclean spirits. And that verse of scripture here goes along with what today's video is about, going to a football game. All those players have a common goal. And they're working together. And same thing here. Jesus is sending people out in Mark chapter 6. And they all have a common goal. Working together. To get that goal is to spread the gospel to the lost. Show that Jesus Christ died for their sins. That they trusted Jesus Christ as Savior. They got to escape going to hell and go to heaven and be with him when they die. That's the whole thing about this message here. And that's the thing I can like, tell you is. We're all working together. Another verse that says, Jesus said, if not, if not against you, they're for you. And that's very clear too. So about working together, working as a team. So we're all a team on the same team. Even football team games. So if, they're, if they're in Christ, they may be the opposite sides of the football field, but they're on the same team in Jesus Christ. So that's the message like the convey with you today so see you next location this is the football game i'm going to show you what we need in football so and here's what we need in football in a football game you need a football because you can't play football without football so right there's a the football you also need a helmet that would be a wise thing to do is play make sure you have your helmet on when you play football and the band you can't forget the band here because they are just important they do a lot of hard work in doing their shows. So we gotta recognize them for their hard work. They put, a, just like the players in the football field, they put in a lot of practice to this. So right here's a band. There's a trumpet, an instrument. Right here's a flag for color guard. And last but not least, you cannot forget the cheerleaders. They also work hard and practice hard too. So you cannot forget the cheerleaders. With their pom-poms, cheering you on, Lean cheers. That makes football so fun. All these components working together. You know, for my road trips, I do. I do a lot of stops. And I have another one here. Just to relax a little bit. And I'll kill some time. Maybe get some, like, support of business here. And I'll show you where, you're at, where I'm at right now. And right here it is. It's Harvey's. Hop in, hop out. Just get some things, you know. For the trip and so I'm right here so I'm right here since I left a little early I had some time to make make some flowers and here they are some flowers I made so right here they are it's funny how these flowers can be used for, used for any occasion so here's some flowers I was able to make now let's hit the road you know as with every road trip you know, you gotta get a bite to eat. So here's why I do this one, where I chose to eat. 
Is that on my toes? This is good stuff. Right here it is. So let's get some. So. So let's get something to eat. I'm here at Amano's, waiting for my food, already ordered. Amano's is, um, there's, the, the owners of this place, their son's the quarterback. He's doing pretty decent this year. So let's wait for my food. I just got something to bite to eat, so now it's off to the game. I'm at the game, as you can tell. I made uh, inside the gates about an hour before kickoff. So, get my seat here. Now, as you can see here, Seals Grove, see the blue. This is their home team, they use, do their home colors. And Berwick is in the white. So, right there it is. And the band is starting to get 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 her too. They'll be performing here too. And you can't forget the cheerleaders. They're wearing pink for breast cancer awareness. So that's how it is here. So another thing is, you know, this should be a good game. Seals Grove is probably expected to win. The problem is injuries. Both Seal and Grove and Berg are facing injuries. And one of them is my injuries is my nephew. He's hurt. So he's out for the season. So if all you prayer warriors out there, say a prayer. For my nephew, so he recovers speedy, recover, good recovery. And also all the other teams, for both teams, injuries too. So. And also, just like a hopefully, I can get you some pretty good highlights. So, see you at the game. Four seven, and as you can see, we have a lot of good highlights here. Good game for the first half. So let's um, see what the second half holds.
touchdown run for the Touchdown by number two, Gavin As you can see here, in the final score, Seals Grove beat Burke without any trouble at all. It was 38 to 20 score was. Good game overall. So, little facts here. This, you know, if it's football, I'll be there. Now, I hope that, that people will see that my first Thing in my life would be Jesus Christ and doing his work and doing whatever I do to glorify him that's number one I hope people can see that number two some people might think is duct tape which okay which that's what this channel is about which they see that or not maybe not really that important but some people think my number two could be duct tape chess sports or hunting so a lot of people have a hard time figuring out what would be number two. But whatever my number two is, or anybody's number two is, not really that important. Because if your number one is Jesus Christ and doing his work, whatever your number two is, it will be something that you'll do to do his work with and to glorify him. So like the verse says, whatever you do, do the glory of God. So, you know, like I said, but it's football, I'll be there. So that's um end right now. So if um I might stop by at some place and finish this. If I do, I should. I might all finish it there. So see you next spot. So I'm at my last stop here to sign off. So thank you for watching. This is Derek Duct Tape Man here saying thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, share, like, vacations. Get more videos of me. This is Derek Duct Tape Man saying see you there. Goodbye.